Alma is a suit of soft armour. I had to leave my studio in the South Downs because um, tenants had arrived there that had much more industrial pursuits and it really clouded my sanctuary and I couldn't create there anymore. So I decided to leave and I found it hard because the things that took my place there were much more involved with money making and industrial things that are important in society and I make my work for joy, I don't really aim to sell it. And so I lost my confidence really as a creator and I thought well perhaps it's not worthwhile to create like this, I'm not going to sell it so what's the point? But when I heard the call for the exhibition it gave me some, fortified me and I, I got on with it. And so this is a suit of soft armour for my spirit, my creative spirit. So I envisage my creativity roaming freely because it hasn't got a home anymore, flying into here and knowing it still exists. And the fact that I have created it for my spirit is witness and shows me that I am still creating wherever I am. So it gives me evidence of my creativity. And I've sort of bound to this suit of armour, my beliefs and commitments. Um, I'm a painter and a textile artist. And I can do it, and I do it well, and here, here it is. I think the fact that I've chosen to put her on a cross-like dress stand, and that it is a christening dress, is an, a new beginning, as a new stage of my life, but also a nod to my faith in life and creativity as a life force and that it helps me to live well and have a good impact in the world. So it, it's a strident statement of my beliefs and commitment. And on her there are poppies that um, were dried and I, I drew from and then painted and the bottom is to represent the downland chalk. As we know about poppies in the, after the war, they rise from, from disturbed ground and they often, they rise in chalky or limey places because that fertilizes the, the poppy flowers. Uh, so it, she holds a nod to that as, as well, that triumphantly rising from destruction or disturbance, I suppose. I'm making a whole suit of armour now. This has given me the courage to go forth and create helmets and shields and um, breastplates. But it's really, it's not as a, an, a defence, it's a kind of protection in the world because I feel our creativity and our creative spirits are really can be quite vulnerable in the face of well, what somebody said to me once, she said, I dig for gold, you dig for joy. And in the face of gold in the world, just digging for joy is a bit, seems a bit small, but I think it has a positive impact and it's worth doing.